So I decided to talk to you guys a little bit about what I've decided to do. So I had a doctor's appointment this morning. Oh my gosh, I look a wreck. I had a doctor's appointment this morning and I talked to them about switching my birth control so that I could take St. John's Wort and he was just like, every birth control is going to be affected by St. John's Wort so like you're going to have to figure something else out. And he was like begging me not to take it and I'm like, why is it not worth a shot if I can take something natural instead of you throwing prescriptions at me? And he was like begging me not to take it. But then he was like, but if you want to, you just go ahead. I'm like, that's why I'm here is because I want to. Like, I was just trying to change my birth control. And so, basically, I just, it'll make the birth control that I have now less effective. So, we're going to have to have more protection, if you know what I mean. But... My mental health is worth more than being able to have sex freely and not worry about it. I mean, we can just use a condom, so not that big of a deal. So, I have taken two since I got home. It is now 1226. And I took two when I first got back here at about 11.30. And I no, I'm not going to like feel any different today or anything. I'm just giving y'all a heads up on like I started taking this and I'm going to be like checking in with y'all and telling y'all how I feel every day. If I think it's helping or not. Because I really believe that this may have been what I needed the whole time. I've been on many different medications my whole life. At one point, they were working pretty well for me. But a couple of them were giving me like high blood pressure, pressure, high cholesterol. And like, they just weren't working overall. Sometimes. So, I feel like. St. John's Wort is worth a shot, and I'm going to give it a shot. They're not going to scare me by saying, oh, it makes your birth control less effective. Like, please don't do it. You don't want to scare me. Like, my mental health is worth more than you throwing prescriptions at me and expecting me to take them instead of trying an all-natural way. Like, it is my choice. And they, like, just weren't giving me a choice. And then they were like, if you want to, just go ahead. And they were all around pretty rude. But I made an appointment with a counselor too to talk to her to see what she thinks. Hello? And she's the same way, whatever, I won't see a counselor. Because there's nothing wrong with taking natural medication. But yeah, I just want to let y'all know what I was doing. And right now I'm about to eat lunch. And then, um see what homework I need to do for this week. I know it's not very much. I just need to edit my final draft of an essay and study for my final exam on Friday. I need to enroll in spring classes on Friday as well, so I'm going to do both of those on the same day when I go to take my test. And for my other class, I think I just have some reading to do, and that's it. So yeah, it should be a pretty easy week again. Last week was pretty easy as well. Um, and I really need to clean these floors of mine because just mopping with pine saw doesn't work anymore. So I'm planning on um, doing some bleach with water and maybe some dish detergent. I know I can't mix bleach with anything. My mom reminded me of that last night. So, yeah. Glad I was reminded. But she said to add a little Dawn dish detergent to the bleach water. And see if that works. And I'm going to not use the mop. I'm going to use like a rag and get down on my hands and knees and try to 
get this up because I will mop really hard like this morning and then um, come now at 12 o'clock like nobody's spilled anything or done anything to it and I'll take like a baby wipe to clean up a spill or something and it'll go across the spill and then across a little bit of other parts of the floor and it's like I'll pick it up like this with the wipe on my hand and it's like black like what did that how am I not getting things up with the mop but yeah if y'all have any suggestions for what I could use please give me suggestions because this floor drives me nuts I'll mop it today by tomorrow it'll be nasty again like what nobody did anything to it Yeah, I'm just going to be checking in with y'all and y'all know how the St. John's War is working. I also took some B12, which I've been slacking on not taking. So I took those two together with my birth control. And they said it doesn't completely cancel out the birth control. It just makes it less effective. So hopefully my cycles and cramps don't get worse. Because I've never had a regular cycle. I've had months where I don't have a period at all, even two, three months where I don't have a period, and then I've had some where I had like three weeks of non-stop bleeding, and then I'll just have three or four more months where I have nothing. So it's just been so regular my whole life, and this is what has helped my cycles stay regular and my cramps not be as bad. So hopefully those still stay the same if like... Preventing pregnancy doesn't stay the same. Fine, whatever. I'll, we'll take care of that. It's fine. But, like, that wasn't the main reason why I got birth control. So, yeah. And I just put Juniper down for a nap. She had, she wanted some waffles for lunch. That's what she pointed to in the freezer. And I heated up some pizza from last night. And I'm going to eat this, watch The Office, and see what housework and homework I need to do and then by that time she'll be getting up and I might show y'all a video later on some different um, toddler learning activities that I made with all the stuff from Dollar Tree so I will show y'all that later probably and if you haven't checked out my other videos, definitely check them out and give me suggestions down below for other videos you'd like to see. Like going into a more elaborate about me or about my mental health issues or um, the married life, being young or having a child young. Anything that y'all want to hear about, I can just make a video. I always try to keep them under 15 minutes because I've been penalized so many times I can't upload the video because it's longer than 15 minutes and as my husband says you will never shut up he knows the meaning in a mean way but I was I say a lot of times oh you're just telling me that to shut up and he told me today like that's obviously not the case because you will never shut up and I just like busted out laughing but yeah I talk so much and I had such a hard time trying to keep it under 15 minutes. Like right now, it's almost at nine minutes. Like, how did I get this far? <laughs> but yeah, um, I'll talk to y'all later. Um, questions, comments, concerns, or suggestions, comment down below. I appreciate any feedback. Definitely like, subscribe, and also follow my mother in law, Crystal Vanner on here on youtube and instagram facebook all that because she has an amazing lifestyle as well so definitely subscribe to her and follow her at her but yeah thank y'all for watching and yeah any suggestions for other videos bye